Pop, 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 pop. Bing. Hello people, I'm Dr. Kayla, the dentist you can ask anything. Welcome to the first episode of the Smile Makeover series where I will be talking about aesthetic dentistry and all things related. This series is something different as I will not just be explaining but sharing and discussing some of my cases as well. Before we start, don't forget to like this video, subscribe to my channel and turn on the notification bell so you don't miss out the next episode. When we talk about smile makeover, we are actually talking about treatments that make your smile more aesthetically pleasing or in simple words, Fantabulous. These treatments can include orthodontics or braces treatment, gingivectomy, veneers, crowns, dental widening, soft tissue surgeries, and more. I know it sounds like a lot, but let me help make your life simple and walk you through some things you must know before getting a smile makeover. The first thing you must know is what is your dental concern, which is what you do not like about your teeth. Understanding your concerns helps us to identify how we can go about your treatment plan. The three most common dental concerns patients have are color, alignment, and the shape and size of your teeth. Color. If you're just concerned about the yellowish color of your teeth, you might just need an in-office dental widening. If your teeth have white, yellow, or brown patches on it, you might have other conditions like dental fluorosis or amylogenesis imperfecta. Dental widening alone might not solve your problems. You might need other treatments like microabrasion, resin infiltration, veneers, or more. If your teeth has specific stains like tetracycline stain, a simple widening might not be able to help and you might need veneers. Alignment. If your teeth are messy, you might need orthodontics treatment or braces. If you have problem involving your facial bone or jaw relation, you might need orthodontic surgery on top of your braces treatment. You can learn more from my Brace Yourself series, link in description. If you just wanted to correct minor malalignment of your teeth while correcting its size and shape, you may consider veneers. This brings us to shape and size. If your teeth are in perfect alignment, your facial profile looks beautiful, wow. but you are not happy about the shape or the size of your teeth, whether it's too squarish or too small or it has jagged edges, we can modify the shape and size of our teeth to veneers or crowns. Different treatment options has different price range. For orthodontics treatment or braces, ceramic or clear aligners usually cost more than conventional metal braces. For veneers, there's a few materials you can choose from like composite veneers or porcelain veneers. Composite veneers typically cost less than porcelain veneers. However, it has a shorter lifespan compared to porcelain veneers due to its material properties. Lastly, let's talk about your life plan. What? Bro, what are you talking about, man? No, 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 we're talking about your future planning. If your dentist has been asking you if you're planning to get married soon or migrate to other countries in near future, we don't mean to pry into your personal life but to plan your treatment better. Treatments like braces is a long-term commitment. Conventional metal braces requires you to attend to your dental appointment every one to two months. If you're planning to migrate to other countries in near future, it might be wiser for you to opt for clear aligners or to get your orthodontics treatment done at where you're going to stay permanently. If you're planning to get married soon or have any significant life events that requires photo shoot, it might be wiser for you to postpone your metal braces treatment or opt for clear aligners. You might want to get your dental widening or veneers done in advance so you can have a perfect smile to flash on your big day. I hope this brief introduction to Smile Makeover can give you a clear idea on what it actually is. I will be discussing in depth about veneers on the next episode so make sure you stay tuned for it. I'm Dr. Kila and I'll see you next time. Bye! Ceramic or... <laughs> the veneers typically... Oh yeah.